Hello class. I did my project on the sun god Ra. Um, the, the sun is to be considered the giver of life because it gives life to all the crops and it warms everything and Egyptians worship the sun as a god. Um, by the 5th dynasty in the 25th, 24th uh, centuries BC, uh, he had become one of the most popular gods. Now, this is my drawing of Ra, uh, my pre-painting. Thank God that this is not graded on skill of art. Um, but anyways, uh, back to what matters. Um, so Ra was considered the king of gods. Um, <laughs> At an early point, his influence spread through the whole country, bringing uh, a lot of attention to uh, attention to Ra. As he was the god of the kings, and he was the the ruler of the earth, the sky, and the underworld. Um, Ra is portrayed as a falcon on the head of a human body. And um, and it's believed that humans were born from the tears of Ra. That's why the Egyptians called themselves the cattle of Ra. Um, in the myth of the celestial cow is recount recounted how mankind plotted against Ra and how he sent his I as the goddess Sekhmet to punish them. As you can see, the stage that I am is when I added the aging effect to my painting. And as you can see, the paintings aren't, it's not a great painting. So again, thank goodness that this isn't a graded on artistic ability. Um, and then here in this photo is a comparison to the original uh, picture that I chose uh, right next to my artwork. And as you can see, I did a decent job, but we'll just leave it at that. Um, but as you can see, the similarity in colors and how the structure is formed. I would like to thank you so much for your time.